talked to Josh Pastner, and, uh, you know, he said that they've had a couple of good days of practice right after that. They talked things out after that. And, I mean, you absorb that type of loss, and it can, uh, goes right to your soul, Tom. One and five away from Atlanta looking for their first ACC road win. They defeated Miami at home. And that's third of it for three. Well, James is just he's going to be really good. Kelly, the sophomore from Stone Mountain, Georgia, elevates over the defenders for two. James thought about the jumper, drives into traffic and puts it off the glass. 6-5, he can make that play. The leading scorer in the losing effort at Notre Dame on Saturday with 14 points. Mike James was 6 of 8 from the floor and canned a couple of threes against the Irish. This is Kelly, wants a three, and he hits it. Say 270 for the senior from Fort Wayne, Indiana. Shot clock down to 7. Had a 19 rebound game earlier, and that's L. Ellis right there. Just racing up and down the court, and that includes L. Ellis. Making his way to the rim for Louisville. New Cole was a teammate of mine. A lot of great talent. Lands the steal against Kelly. Debo Coleman early, and then watch this one coming from behind. That's a clean rejection. Tech plays very tough to work against. Trainer. Okora four. Saved it. Withers. Three ball. There he is. So four four made that play. Saves it happened. So Ellis, number three, coming through your picture, is back in. Miller out. Now Ellis is going to be off the floor very much. Withers. Another three for Withers. He's only played in five games this season. Parts lose the handle. Maxwell. That's this again. Reloads and hits the three. The Georgia Tech has. He can carve out some minutes. Freshman forward from Riga, Latvia. Lands has the bucket for Louisville. Now the three he made just his second of the season. That's Ellis for the three. Follow! Bending the rim and it's Trainer. Leaping ability for number 12 in white. And Louisville really packed in defensively in that zone. Kelly. Perfect form and he hits the three. You know, you, you look at up and down this lineup, Tom, another offensive rebound. Roosevelt Wheeler shrugging off the uh, double foul. Defending Franklin. Shot clock winding down. Coleman, three-pointer for Georgia Tech. From three-point real estate, as Mike mentioned, just one of ten on conventional jumpers. Follow Franklin. He'll jam it for Tech. Shot clock winding down for Withers, and he held that follow through for an extra beat. Man, that is fantastic. A great moment between the G-Man and Kenny Payne at the shoot-around today as Coleman knocks down a three. There wasn't much time for Kenny in his in his years in Philadelphia. I mean, Charles Barkley was our small forward, and Ronnie Anderson coming off the bench. That's Curry close to the rim. His last 12, 8.6 rebounds, shooting about 58%, so he's starting to feel more comfortable. First points in the game for Curry. Sturdivant will launch a three and hit it for Georgia Tech. Franklin trying to fill the lane. Maybe deserved a better fate, Mike. Lands with the kick out. James steps into the jumper and makes it. It's a three. Louisville had the halftime lead against Syracuse and at Boston College. The ACC games lost both of those as Franklin goes to the rim aggressively. Makes his presence known in this game. A pretty quiet first half for him. Just four points. Make it six, G-Man. Yep. He plays with a lot of abandon, especially in the pain area. Kelly. He'll hit that baseline jumper for Georgia Tech. Long rebound to Ellis. Yeah, and I got you know, they just wanted to test that, see if the touch was still there. I got to think that shooting, that three-point shooting percentage is going to come down. And Ellis doing what he does. Ellis. Thread that needle to Curry. Basket and foul for the cards. Over the shoulder to Curry. Looking for a jam. Second effort. Foul was called after feed from Ellis. Individual spin cycle. 
Couldn't finish. Too much spin. Moore with the hammer. Again, late in the shot clock for Sturdivant. Has to fire away. Long rebound to Moore. Sturdivant, the cutter, and it falls. And he'll go to the free throw line. Louisville led by as many as seven in that first half and five at halftime. Gliding in is Sturdivant. And he has been terrific getting to the paint from Southern Cal. Kyle Sturdivant. Slamming it home. Sturdivant again. Puts on the brakes and hits. Sturdivant had 18 points at Notre Dame earlier this season. No losing effort. They get it to Moore. Moore for with the block. Touchdown pass. Okora for the catch. The shoulder. The turnaround rejected. You no, know Bobby's watching from somewhere tonight. Trainer out jumped by Franklin, and that's tough to do. Sturdivant hesitation dribble. Weak side. Here comes Franklin. Here's a leading score for Louisville with 14. Has not scored yet in the second half. Turn around from Trainer. Ellis against Miles. Nowhere to go. Need some help. Ellis has been quiet for a while. Withers wants it. And hits the three. Right in front of his own bench. Career high for made threes in a game for Jalen Withers. Kelly got it back and put it in. Well, what they did, nice job of keeping him in front that time, making him settle for the jump shot. He has been very effective getting to the rim. Dallas, the trainer. Working deep into the shot clock for trainer. Double on the baseline, couldn't find Wheeler. Miles on the run. Miles Kelly lays it in. 16 points for Miles Kelly. Trainer from the corner. We're going to run some clock, be patient, but this team has to give themselves a little bit extra at the end to finish. James with a little extra from number one. Ellis. Launches a three and hits it for Louisville. Kenny Payne gets his first ACC victory. 68-58 is the final count and the respect.